Hello, welcome to this drum lesson for rolling air raid vehicle in brackets, I think. Don't know what that is. Um, by Limp Biscuit. So, this is a bit of a new metal banger um, by the great John Otto, taking it to the Matthews Bridge. So, I've got the intro, and then when the drums come in, kind of like a big build section, which I believe the first time is 16 bars, but then every other time it's more like eight or four bars. We're doing kicks on one and, one and one and, three and three and, and filling in those gaps with the eighth notes on the, on the snare with like ghost notes. So try and get those as quiet as you can. So that's kind of like this. And then slowly as it builds up, we're kind of opening the hats. And then before it comes into the chorus, we're kind of adding more kicks. So you're kind of going eight quarter notes, adding all the quarter notes. All the eighth notes. And then we're into the chorus, which is on the, the, the hats. And it goes on to the crash. So that pattern, we're doing kicks on one, the last sixteenth note for one. And then that extra snare is, I believe, on 3E. And then an extra kick on the last 16th note. And then halfway through the, the chorus, it does that once on the crash. So the same pattern, but you're just doing it on the crash. But you'd think he'd kind of carry that on, but it only actually does that one time round and then it goes back to the hats. It's kind of cool because it, you think it's just gonna stay on that, but then it kind of comes, it doesn't go back down really, but it's kind of, it's quite a nice thing to, not to just go to the crash and then stay on it. Um, and then the verse, we drop down into this pretty cool pattern, um, which is, so you've got kicks on one, two and, three and, and then the last 16th note of four, which makes a kind of 16th note, well, makes a 16th note bass drum, two, two doubles close to each other, because you're going back to the one. And then you're back to that kind of build bit. If you're having trouble with the ghost notes, you can just, just drop them out. And, and also, that, that adding all those kicks is quite hard, especially if you're doing it with one bass drum. So you can just, you can just keep the quarter note thing going, so you can just go. Still would work great. The other little bit is, I think it's the third verse. Um, it adds this nice little thing. So it's the same kind of pattern. Quite tricky. So you're basically every backbeat two and four. Uh, you 
basically doing like a little rough, which is like a double and then a. <laughs> and then go into cross stick. Yeah, you're doing kind of two drags. And then the cross stick bit and then another drag at the end. Um, yeah, quite tricky that. Right, well, hopefully that's a little bit of insight into the brain of Jan Addo. God, there's a lot of, uh, blimey, just realised how much dust there is on my microphones. Need to do a bit of dusting. Okay, see you next time.